Hey, sis, is that a town over there at the end of the bridge? Yeah, and I don't know why, but something about it takes me back. Let's park it here. Sure. Feasted my eyes on one of these in a swell spell. Right then. Pleasant journey. Where did those tickets come from? In the Chrome Age Shores, I was provided with everything we could ever need. Yep, yep. Uh, okay then. So why a semi lifetime pass? And not a lifetime one? This place rules! Yeah, it's like something right out of a fantasy. Hey, Tama, why don't you hit your ride? Roger the Dodger! Pardon me. Huh? If I may ask, would you be kind enough to tell me what country you hail from? Oh, us? We're, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Bahamu? What? A Bahamu? Well, the Bahamutian Federation has a whole army of mirages in their employ. Huh? Someone's made a whole army out of them? Sounds just fine by me. Line them up nice and neat for us, so we can round them up. Huh? Hey, wait up! Uh, one! All right, oh you Bahamoos. What's your beat, huh? You and the make it sound like they're made of beef. <sighs> yeah, Lon. Don't you know it's a mistake? Ha <laughs> ha! 
Why wasn't I able to imprison that mirage? Didn't you see the light that's surrounding it? That means it's the beholden to another keeper. The what? B.O.? A smell? Uh, no! What I mean is, the mirage already has another the master. So until you give their boss the old heave the hoe, you won't be able to claim it for yourself. Giants. Oh, oh, whoops. whoops. Are they Bahamutian the soldiers? soldiers? But they drove the mirages off of us. It's just like the, the prophecy, prophecy. Word, for word. word for word. But which one? Which one? Well, well, we know how it ends. Please, may I speak with you? Huh? Uh, uh, sure. Two of you. You've traveled here from another world. Oh, well, I wouldn't... I mean... Actually, I think you're pretty much spot on. And we're Mirage Keepers, too. Come don't tell her! Why not? Face it, we're too awesome to try and hide it. I'm, like, exuding all over. Mon, you don't even know what exude means. There is someone who'd like to have a word with you. Could you possibly stop by Castle Cornelia? So let's find this Casa Cornelius place. Doesn't Casa mean up? It's gotta be higher up. Well, you've not got the direction correct. Even if the rest of that was completely off the base. That woman must be important if she's inviting us to the castle. What's up, guys? Nice armor. Leave them alone, please. Thank you for coming. Welcome to the Kingdom of Cornelia. I am Princess Sarah. Wait, you're like a princess? We had no idea. Oh my gosh. I am so sorry Lon acted like such a royal idiot. I'm not royal. Oh, and I'm his older sister, Rain. It's an honor. Please forgive the ruse. At first, I suspected that you might be agents sent here by Bahamut. I was wrong. You stood up bravely against their mirages and kept our town safe. All of Cornelia thanks you. Oh, I wouldn't say we were that brave. Really? <sighs> Stop, you're so modest. Still, the fact of the matter is, we didn't do anything all that outstanding. Yeah, we're more the instanding types. Pretty sure that instanding isn't an actual the word. <laughs> oh, forgive me. It's just so hard to believe that you two are the stuff of prophecies. Prophecies? Oh, that's right. I think I heard the townsfolk going on about some kind of prophecy too. Oh, I am sorry. If you will permit me, I will explain it from the beginning. You see, Cornelia is an unfederated state midway up Grimoire. Unfederated? Yes. Let me explain that as well. The majority of Grimoire's countries and municipalities have annexed themselves to the Bahamutian Federation under the rule of Brandalus, the Herald King. Cornelia, however, has continued to maintain its sovereignty. The Federation has made attempts to erode this stance countless times. But we have held our ground, 
And now Bahamut has taken to armed provocation. You mean like that Mirage attack before? Yes. So where does this prophecy factor in? The Azure prophecy speaks of a divergence. When time begins its march anew, they shall return as visitors. Giants from the hills of a world not our own. Upon Grimoire, they will wreak two divergent futures. One that brings salvation, and the other ruin. An enigma to confound even the highest mind. The giants may... wreak two futures? Wreak, huh? Oh, man! Tama, this prophecy's about you! What? What are you even talking about? There's nothing wrong with the way I smell! You think that dummy! Well, at least I'm dumber than you! <laughs> I'm afraid there's just no hope for them. Oh. So, the giants from the hills, as in, what hills? I guess it's one of those believe what you want to things. But yeah, so far it does seem to match up. Um, do you mind if I ask you a slightly awkward question? If this federation is really so terrible, why have so many countries agreed to become members? Most of the mirages in Grimoire, not all, but certainly most of them, are now firmly under the Federation's control. With such a powerful army behind them, citizens can go about their lives without fearing the mirages that still roam free. Dude, they control that many mirages? Seriously? Y yes Uh, dude. Whoa. King Grandless's Herald Lieutenants, known as Siguardus and Pelinor, Command all of Grimoire's mirages with the same authority as the famous Queen of the Keepers of ages past. So there was a Queen of the Keepers? Sounds like she was pretty powerful. Yes, but that was more than a century ago. So, sorry for the string of dumb questions, but if the Federation can guarantee that kind of absolute protection, wouldn't it be worthwhile to take them up on their offer? It may seem wise. But you see, membership in the Federation involves following their laws and adoption of a heinous creed. It chills me right to the marrow of my bones. That bad? Yes. I beg you, see for yourselves. Once you've done so well, you will understand. All right then. Now then, may I ask what the two of you intend to do next? Well, whatever's going on out there, the only thing we can do right now is just keep rounding up more mirages, am I right? Oh. Apparently, at one time we commanded a whole legion of them. But somehow, we lost them along with our memories. So, we're hoping by getting the mirages back, we might stumble on some clues about our past. That's right. So if mirages like those goblins are bugging you, we can lay down the smack. Lay down the what? Uh, I think... What he's trying to say is we'll help you out, or at least in the best way we know how. Oh, wonderful. You have my thanks. Mine and all Cornelius. Still, if we're going to be any help, don't you think we need to beef up our arsenal first? Because we can't put up much of a fight without some strong mirages. Good point. Princess, do you know of any nearby places where strong mirages live? Certainly. If you travel to the northeast of Cornelia, You'll find the Nether Nebula, a network of caverns inhabited by many wild mirages. Ooh, nice! Not at all. Savage mirages have been sighted in the nebula. You may well end up dead. Th that's cool. If you insist upon going, then please take the utmost caution. He will, your highness. Otherwise, he's gonna be extremely sorry! Wait a minute, why just me? What did I do? It looks like we'll need to wind our way down to reach the exit. Seems that way. What a funny way to build a town. Oh, it's not that this strange to the people of Grimoire. Hey, while we're here, why don't we ask around town and to see what we can find out? Uh, what am I 
gonna do? Oh, say, you wouldn't happen to be the giants from the hills by any chance, would you? You see, there's a situation I'm dealing with where I could really use your assistance, since you must know Raja so well. Could I trouble you to please bring me an earth hammer? If you could, I would be forever in your debt. Just one good area. After our grimoire, you'll find places. Save the locations that lead back here. Open the way to come and go as you please. And how exactly do we do that? You already the saw. Just walk up to the right place, and that's all it takes. But surely a means of transportation that handy must come with a catch? No, the catch! You can use the gate as the little or much as you like. What's more, time in here and time in Grimoire, they don't both flow at the same speed. So whatever crisis is going to down, you can put it on hold and kick back here till you're ready. Whoa, it's like magic! Yeah, really irresponsible magic. Just imagine revisiting any place we've been! Call it the Super Porta Park! Are you the kidding? That name definitely gets an F. He deserves an H. An H? But grades only go down to F! Extra, extra, read all about it. What, what do you the one here, Seraphy? In case you're wondering, you can use the prism case anywhere you find one of these gates. I think I would get it now. Gates are the what you meant when you talked about a strong connection. Huh? Oh, right, right. That's the gist of it. To the Nether Nebula. Chapter 3 Old Acquaintances She said the Nether Nebula is somewhere northeast of Cornelia, right? Time to go hustle and rustle a little mirage muscle. Just don't hustle so much that you get yourself lost, okay? I might just leave you there. <laughs> When's the last time I got... Don't push it. Okay. Here is so clean. Yeah, right? Yahoo! You're a Yahoo. Wait, no, no, Rain. You need to shout for it to work. Yahoo! Be 
Oh, the mirages in here are a lot the stronger than any you faced the before. Yeah, let's not mess around in the never neba thing on the bob. Never? Nebula, do you think you can do something about that habit of forgetting the name of virtually everything? Oh, here's another gate. That's the right. Gates, they usually turn up in towns or at the start of most mirage-infested areas. You never have to travel far to the visit a place you've been. Whenever you want to get from point A to point the B, just use the gate as a handy little shortcut. A shortcut, huh? So, like, if we wanted to go back to Cornelia right this instant, we could just take this gate back to Ninewood Hills, then we can take the gate from there to Cornelia. You see? All in all, it makes for a pretty short shortcut. Yeah! If it were hair, you'd have to call it... You'd have to call it a buzz cut! Okay. Come on, Let's follow, Let's follow this, this rabbit, rabbit hole as far as it goes. Yeah, yeah fine. fine. Just, Just behave, behave yourself. yourself.
This dungeon is way more dungeony than I thought. Did you know that originally dungeon referred to the biggest tower in a castle? It's what they called the castle keep. How long has it been since I've heard Rain go off on one of her educational rants? Are you kidding me? Mirages can stack too? Yep, you're not the only ones who get way the stronger when you're piled up. Do their abilities change when they're stacked to them? That afraid the so. Which means somebody needs to stop underestimating the enemy before he defines himself up to his neck in some... Okay. At least he knows the warning's meant for him. she gets, the more she tries to cover it up by sleep. You know where the word trivia comes from? Sis, I think we're good. That was a good butt. Good job. We got this. I guess we're doing this.
This for it's a strange switch that the response to mirages. The mirages who imprison me inside these caves should be able to help you out.
new path. Check out that switchcraft. Yep. Now we know which way to the go. Whichever one of you thinks you're being clever is about to get a knuckle sand switch. Did did I just get owned? I'm the raising the white flag here too. I guess we're doing this. Come on, break it. Oh, that? I guess Anna Crow is the trying to give you some tips. Dude, really? And here I thought I was some kind of super genius coming up with all the answers on my own. I hate to the break it to you, but you are never the be a bad person. I know. It's so sad. Whoa, hey now, come on. 
You don't have to look that broken hearted when you say it. Oh, uh, what's this? Oh, that's not the good. This is the call a threshold. Mirages the create them to mark their territory. When you see a threshold, you better watch out because the mirages inside are extremely the powerful. And the worst part, if you cross it and lose a fight the inside, I can't use my powers to rewind time and extricate you. No extrication? Guess we'd better be extra careful then. <laughs> <sighs> anyway, it sounds like if we're going in, we better go in fully prepared. That's the for sure! And don't forget to save your progress too. I expected some foolhardy adventurer with a terminal case of curiosity. What's this? Well, look who's back. Ah, the half pints. Hail and well met. Hail and well met? That's not our names! I think he just means hello. Oh, and for the record, he happens to be a half-wit and a half-pint. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. Huh? What's so funny? Oh, you're having a lawn moment. Guess I'll just add this one to the pile. Wait, what pile? There's a pile? Apparently, we've met the three of you before, although we don't remember it. You do not remember us? Really? No wonder they haven't summoned us. Then our course of action is clear. We must ensure the pecking order is pecking in the right order. If you seek to command the three of us again, then demonstrate your strength now or else we destroy! Hold now. Why must you two always let the blood rush to your head? W uh, what do you mean? 
Would you just look at them? These are not the Mirage Keepers we knew. Hi. You're right. They do look rather... How do I put it? Put what? Mom does set the bar low. Like Limbo the bar low. Hmm? Oh, I see. See what? Very well. What say we pit them against just one of us to keep things nice and fair? Hmm, agreed then. Go on, choose from among us and choose wisely. Choose for what? Time certainly has not made you any more clever. What we're trying to say is, the two of you are no match for all three of us at once. Which means... Right, I get it. Thanks. Now, let's see. Huh? Wait, get what? Choose me! I know you've missed it. Step now into the searing embrace of my hellfire! Care to play? I'll send chills in your spine and right through your heart with my diamond dust. Chills are ready to knock us cold. Knock us cold for what? Help me out here. I hope this doesn't traumatize you. You'll make a wonderful addition to my man. Diamond dust! <laughs> 